Hi Libra, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to Angel Love 333. Hope everybody is doing fantastic. Getting ready here to do your reading. We're going to see who you are connecting with here in love. Please know it is a general reading, may not resonate with everybody out there. Roles and energies can be reversed. If this reading resonates with you, there will be an extended reading link in the description box and in the comments. I will look at the next four weeks energy moving forward. It gives you some timing. I will dive deeper into your person. So with that, let's just get into your reading. Let's see what the energy is here from my beautiful Libras. Let's see energy here for Libra. Definitely picking up your energy here. All right. So we have the Knight of Pentacles, the Devil. We got strong Capricorn energy. Interesting. Very interesting. I'm just going to start off here. Bottom of the deck here, you do have the Queen of Swords, which I feel I'm picking up your energy. I feel you're in this very discerned energy. I know what I want. I'm very clear about what I want. And I see somebody coming towards you with a message with this Knight of Pentacles. Could be a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo. We have the Devil energy here too with that. And I feel like this is someone that is going to try to hold on to you. But I feel like because of this devil energy, it feels like this is somebody who maybe did something. It was behavior they knew they shouldn't have done, but they did it anyway. And I feel like here you are, four of cups. You realize that you're very hesitant because of what happened here. Now, what's interesting with the four of cups, this could be an indication that there could be somebody that's toxic or somebody who... You know, you didn't like the behavior or something that they did. This could be somebody that you felt rejected or ignored from. I'm picking up that energy as well. There's other options here, but I'm not too sure yet if that's you or somebody else. So let's just keep going and we'll see. We're going to clarify as well. Thank you, Spirit and Angels, for your guidance. What other messages do you have here? All right, for Libra. Yeah, we got strong Leo energy. We have the tower. Yeah, something happened with this person. It caused a tower moment. Uh, it's a card of instability. Let's see what else comes out. Two major arcana cards, three major arcana cards there. Yeah, nine of pentacles and the seven of pentacles. Yeah, I feel like this is somebody uh, that you pull back your energy from. But I, I sense here there is going to be a message because I see somebody, yep, somebody coming around, somebody who misses you, somebody who wants to work on things with you. Now, what's interesting about this Four of Cups, now it could be a surprise that you're going to hear from this person, but this is an Ace of Cups, and in, in this card, it also talks about a surprise from the universe. Now, this could be an indication that you may get a new love offer besides this other situation that I'm seeing here, because I see your energy is very, very attractive here with this Nine of Pentacles. This is you looking good, taking care of yourself, feeling at peace. Maybe, maybe feeling very grounded, but I feel there's an unstable situation with a particular person, and I see that you have your guard up with this person. It does feel like this is someone that you have spent a lot of time thinking or reflecting about this person. I feel you have some time invested with this person as well. So... Now, I'm going to say with this, this Three of Pentacles, there is that possibility there could have been a third-party situation uh, that happened here as well. But let's uh, pull some Love Oracles and then we'll clarify. Thank you, Spirit. What other messages do you have for Libra about who Libra is connecting with? Or what else do they need to know? Yep, there it is. I said it with the Knight of Pentacles, a text message. Communication. Somebody I feel like you've been trying to be really disciplined with this person, like not contact them, not reach out. Oh my gosh, I can't make it up. Look at that, the snake. Yeah, this person deceived you in some sort of way. 
It could be somebody that you are very tempted by. Didn't I call it? Oh my gosh, Libra. Every card. I said there could be a new love. Now it could be, I'm, I'm going to say here, we're going to clarify. It could be that this is someone who is wanting a new beginning with you. That can be this energy as well. Let's pull another card. Yep, and a date. Somebody wanting to meet up with you. Somebody who is a temptation, but I do sense they did something shady here. I said it here too, something that they knew they shouldn't have done. You do have the home card on the bottom of the deck, and you also have social media. So this is someone I feel they've been spying on you, or they could be driving by your home, checking up on you. Now that devil card could also be somebody who's very jealous. This could be somebody very jealous, maybe worried that you are dating other people because you're, you know, very attractive or looking really good. Wow. Let's uh, do some clarifying here. Tell me more about this devil energy. Tell me more about this devil energy. Someone who deceived you is now preparing to come towards you. I feel like you kind of grew, um, you have grown from this connection, this relationship. It could even be a relationship that you outgrew. But this is someone preparing for union here, that ascension energy. So I feel like your energy outgrew this person because of their behavior. And now this person is preparing to reunite with you. Yep, there it is, Page of Cups. Again, communication. Now this could be somebody too who has also grown from this connection coming towards you with an apology because look, there's the Five of Swords. This is someone who was playing games. Maybe it was somebody who, like I said, involved you in a third party situation. Tell me more about this tower. Yeah, healing heart. There's an energy of someone coming towards you wanting to heal this. Tell me more about this tower. Yeah, magician. This is someone who is going to take some sort of action, trying to manifest you back in their life. Who deceived you? Tell me more about this snake energy. Tell me more about this snake energy. Oh boy, twin flame. This is a twin flame connection, which makes a lot of sense because I feel like there has been growth. There's ascension here between the two of you. Tell me more about this snake. Yeah, five of swords. Yeah, someone that you had a conflict with. Someone who was out for themselves. We do have temperance. Could be a Sagittarius. So this shows me, yes, yeah, somebody coming towards you wanting union. Now, some of you, it may be a complete surprise that you hear from this person. Because it doesn't have to be the last person you dated. Or whatever your situation is. This could be somebody who is coming towards you wanting to give you an apology for their actions. Let's clarify this Four of Cups now. We just, you know, because we just saw that Four of Cups. Tell me more about this Four of Cups. Because there's something I feel there's a surprise. And you're not expecting this, but you're hesitant. Oh my gosh. Look at that. You got the engagement ring card. I'm just going to say some of you, it could be an engagement. Some of you, it can just be union. You have date. It can also be commitment. So this person is going to try and meet up with you again is really what I'm seeing. Tell me more about this Four of Cups. Tell me more about this Four of Cups. Yep, Ace of Pentacles. Someone I feel that didn't treat you right in the past is coming towards you and they're coming towards you serious. Wanting a new beginning a possibility new love but I feel this is the same person there's three other cups so there may be other people I don't know if you're out there dating or maybe there are people who are interested in you tell me more about um, this new love let's do that yeah someone who wants to rebuild the connection here butterflies on the bottom of the deck they want to take things to the next level, the next phase here. Look at that. You got soulmates on the bottom of the deck. 
So yeah, plain and simple here. This person wants a new beginning. Tell me more about new love. Yeah, there's a very strong connection between you and this person. I feel there's a lot of love here. There's mutual feelings. You have the Knight of Pentacles. See, here's that message again. That message because somebody feels guilty. Somebody feels guilty and they are sad or feeling at a loss without you. Very strong, clear energy. A lot of times this doesn't happen in a reading, but that's what I'm really picking up here for you, Libra. I'll see what else comes out. What else can you share with Libra? What else does Libra need to know? Okay, so this could be male or female. Someone who has a lighter than darker skin. May not resonate with everybody, but we also have here freedom. So that is an energy of someone coming towards you, taking that risk, that leap of faith. You've got career. Now, this could be somebody that you work with, or this could be somebody who's like very business-like, successful type of energy. I'm going to say, too, this could be someone who likes their freedom. That could be kind of not that it excuses their behavior, but that could be why, why they had that behavior. Uh, you also have here wallflower. So this is you kind of feeling like not content about the situation. You pulling back your energy. You have gifts. So you may receive a gift from this person. And it's also a surprise. See, I see you here, right? You pull back your energy. And that's, again, I feel like you're going to get a message from this person when you're not expecting it. You do also have your family. Two of you is to be different for everybody. Two of you could have children together or a child together. This also can talk about a soul family. So there may just be very strong soul ties here or family is important, um, I feel. I feel like too, this could be someone who keeps in touch with your family. Maybe they, uh, you know, are bringing gifts to your family. It's going to be different for everybody. And you also have here fun times. Yeah, so this person's really going to try and connect with you again is what I'm really picking up. I feel like they're going to try and meet up with you, date you. I'm going to get some uh, hidden truths in a moment. We also have here spiritual growth. I feel this is a connection between you and this person where both of you have grown and I feel like you've been apart and it's you're going to hear from this person and you're not going to be expecting it when it happens. Let's get um, some hidden truths from your person. What does this person want to say? So many things remind me of you. I hope you can forgive me one day. You speak to me through music, so they must be listening to music and they and they really think about you. Again, here's the forgiveness. Something that they did, they knew they shouldn't have done, and that's what I'm saying. Some of you are going to get an apology from this person. And I'm afraid to contact you. I feel like this person would have contacted you sooner, but they have, you know, like I said, you got that protective sword up there and they may have been afraid to. So I'm going to pull some final messages here. We're going to see how is this person coming towards Libra? And then I'm going to take it to the extended. Like I said, I'm going to dive deeper and go out four weeks to see where the energy goes. This person's very determined coming towards you. I see that they want from out of the cold, maybe you've given this cold person the cold sh shoulder, maybe you detached from this person, but I see with the Empress energy, which is your energy, they want a new beginning. They want communication. They want to feel your nurturing and your kind energy is what I get there. And, you know, here's the three of wands. They want the opportunity where things can grow between the two of you, where 
they can build a foundation with you. So they want to take the steps coming towards you to build this connection, this relationship. Remember that we have here the Ace of Pentacles. I do feel like with that engagement ring energy, they're going to come towards you. They're going to tell you they want commitment or they want to work on things towards something long term. That is the energy that I am feeling here. They're trying to secure things with you. So Libra, I'm going to take this to the extended. We're going to see how it plays out. I hope to see you there. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of the day or evening. And I'm sending you angel love.